<laughs> All right, so back to this honorable member where slap that boat driver. And they go through his page, like if you scroll through his page, click this particular post, see the caption, waiting for my Uber. This was in 2020. Now, he don't talk to honorable member, you know, if he wait for Uber again, it can't be as if this politics for Nigeria immediately you enter inside, you go call wicked. Or maybe because of saying in Nigeria, because I don't understand how you are waiting for your Uber. You even took a picture, you are proud of it. The facade, so now you have become an honorable member representing your constituency. All of a sudden, the Uber come meet you for front of your door. And as the guy says, Oh, guy, it is food, pick it up. You start to slap him. You say, You go buy him. You go make him disappear. You go pay 50 million, make him buy him. You go lock him for your generator house. Say, You foretell your policeman, make him beat him. You can't even say, Make the inspector general of police make it come here. Talk him as if IG now your boy. Well, um, we go see how this thing end. We go see how we end. Now, I saw an apology that the guy did. To be very honest, that thing is not an apology. That is not an apology at all. If he wanted to apologize, he would have pointed straight to the thing that he did. Like, okay, sorry, you boat driver for what I did. I wasn't supposed to do that. I'm really sorry. Apologize directly. You're apologizing to Nigerians because Nigerians react the way Nigerians are reacting. It's crazy. I can't even see him for police station himself. You see, they even raise shoulder at the pass. He won't carry him near me. Now, because people did it, I just yeah, it's normally, normally to say that guy and my brother for where you 500 first may police lock me. Land you better one. See the kind of person where they are, where, where they are, salt. very smallish guy to say, I'll wear you like 500 now. You for red, very red man. Are you for turn to? It's crazy. Now, back to the comments I've been seeing. The boat driver was rude. The boat driver was rude. This one, that one. The boat driver was rude. Some people say, for carrying a go meter for a double bus, I am laughing at you people. Shayna, we soon are the fine. Very, very soon. I don't want to hear complain who, that when boat driver came to deliver something, you were in the, in the room. You did not know that boat driver was doing forceful entry on your 10 years old daughter. And I don't want to hear Ramu. While I was I told the boat driver to do doorstep delivery. He went into my house. He carried my jewelries. The guy goes inside my house. Go carry my laptop. He carried my PS5. He carried my card. I know one year I'm I know one year I'm. Because I never hear before say a boat driver come. They say me carry and come doorstep. The one one I know now. Guy, where you doing? I'm outside. Okay, I'm coming out to pick it. That's the one I know. You understand? That's the one I know. A lot of that they do damage control. Now they do tribalism on top of the matter. I see a lot of you doing tribalism on the matter. I just look on my head and shake. I say, when I want Nigeria better. But anyways, let's wait and see how this thing will end, right? Let's wait and see. As of now, now come back on tell the status of thing. Meanwhile, I want to know what the Inspector General of Police will do. I just the wait, make a look at Since they say, if you call, call the IG to come here now. Hey, we. Ah, no, they know the respect IG for this country again. It's sad. But anyways, let's hope and see what the IG will do at the end of the day. Peace and love. Don't play. He's gonna learn. And he will learn the hard way.